Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying Olipop. This is a sparkling tonic, uh, which I like the name tonic. Um, anyway, this is the vintage Coke uh, or Cola, vintage Cola, strawberry vanilla, gra classic grape, orange squeeze, classic root beer, and then ginger lemon. These were not cheap. They're $2.49 each at Whole Foods. But we've seen them at Kroger as well, and they're expensive at Kroger too. They're just expensive little cans. Uh, they are in the refrigerated section. You have to keep them refrigerated, it says. Um, store refrigerated. We've spent years crafting a drink that's as good for your digestion as it, as, as it is delicious. I can talk today. Olipop combines the benefits of prebiotics, plant fiber, and botanicals in a sparkling tonic that supports your microbiome and benefits digestive health. With notes of cinnamon, vanilla, and caramel, our old-style cola evokes both the new and familiar while gently lifting the spirits with a mix of green tea caffeine and alpha galanical extract. Whatever that is. We won't even pretend we know what that is. Um, it is a non-GMO, verified, gluten-free, vegan, paleo. Um, this is a 12 ounce container it is one can is 35 calories so a regular size can for two dollars 49 cents do you want the can that's fine okay it tastes very flat mm -hmm. it's not bad the flavor's not bad it's just tastes it's honestly, I didn't know, I didn't know what to expect going in, but um, I see the goal is actually to have the, what it is on the can. I mean, they're really trying to, um, well, I didn't know if it was going to be, uh, I didn't know what kind of a drink it was going to be like, and they've actually gone for a cola, um, but it is a very, very flat Color. It's not very, yeah, it's not very carbonated. The carbonation itself is not a lot present, really strong, and the flavor is kind of, it's just it does. Re it reminds you like an RC or something it, like that. Yes, I would. Yes, I would say that. Uh, for as expensive as it is, I would compare it. I wouldn't compare it to a Coke. I would compare it more to an RC level drink, but very, very flat and not as sweet. It's not bad though. I know. Uh, I don't think I it's bad. It. How many calories? Is it? If if somebody if the doctor told me, Tammy, you can never have a Coke again or a Pepsi, but you can have this. Olipop, that'll take the place of your Coke. Would I drink it? Yes, I would. And if you would get used to it. I guess it. you're if looking for any of the benefits that it adds. If you, if you um, I don't know about the scientific proof of any of that stuff. If you, if you want to do that kind of stuff with the microbiome and all that stuff, then if that's true, um, then yeah, that's, that's fine to drink. Right. This is the strawberry vanilla. It's also 35 calories. Our take on a classic cream soda blends real strawberry juice, vanilla bean, and a dash of lemon to create a modern and scrumptious treat that's sure to hit the spot every time. I don't know. I, I that's the strawberry. Pink champagne yeah. kind of color. Very strong vanilla. I like that much better than the it's color. Stronger. Mm -hmm. Well, you actually taste the strawberry. Mm -hmm. I taste the strawberry. That's what makes stronger flavor. Yeah, I taste the strawberry and I taste the vanilla, mm -hmm. and it's just a better flavor it's than still that flat, flat Coke flavor. Yeah, it still is flat, but it's not. It tastes better flat than the Coke tastes flat. Yeah, yeah, that's true. It's very lightly carbonated. I, won't, I shouldn't say flat. It's very lightly carbonated. I would, I would definitely choose the strawberry vanilla over the, color. over the color. I would too. This is classic grape, which I love grape. We're giving grape an upgrade made from real Concord grape juice with a hint of lime to create the perfect blend of sweet and tart. And our classic grape is the nostalgic flavor you know and love all grown up. This one is 45 calories. Even though they're lightly carbonated, it's going to make you want to burp. <laughs> I haven't gotten that feeling yet. I like the color. It 
Ooh. Oh, wow. That's just Strong like bread. communion. <laughs> like a uh, Concord bread. It tastes just like communion. If you've ever had communion at a church. If you've ever drank Concord grape juice. <laughs> then that, there you go. That's The big fat purple grape. That, I like it. I think it's good. It's I good, drink actually. that all the time. But either one of those two I, I could drink. And, and the light carbonation actually goes really well with that. Okay. This is Orange Squeeze. It says our Orange Squeeze reinvents orange soda with a citrusy vitamin C rich blend of natural ingredients. Clementine and mandarin oranges collide with a hint of lemon to produce a bright twist on the nostalgic classic. It is also 45 calories. Okay. All of these have different colors. So mm -hmm. it'll be fun to line them up at the end so you can see them in a picture. Mm. Now see, I like that. I could drink it. I like it a lot. Mm. It uh, to me, it tastes uh, like a watered down Kool Aid, but it but it does have that um, carbonation. So the carbonation adds a little bit of harshness to it. But I've actually had orange Kool Aid. It reminds me very much of orange Kool Aid. It's um, it reminds me of those little Clementine oranges. Uh -huh. um, but it's um, I don't know. It's got a little bitterness to it that that like the white part that you don't want to eat. Right. Um, it kind of reminds me of that flavor instead right. of the pure orange flavor. It's, it's okay. I could drink it, but it's not, it wouldn't be my pick. I did not get the white part, <coughs> but I understand that Kevin did. Um, I believe him. Uh, this is classic root beer, our old-fashioned root beer. Melds just the right mix of classic bite and creamy sweetness with extracts of sweet birch, smooth vanilla bean, and real burdock root. It is back to 35 calories. Okay. Smells like root beer. Oh, it actually really tastes like root beer. Mm -hmm. They might have other flavors of this, but these were the only ones at Whole Foods. And we got lucky with the vintage cola at Whole Foods because we only found five. Like Whole Foods has this whole section of cans and bottles and stuff like that. That's where these came from. But then, so we had picked out five of them and we went up front and they have the little refrigerators as you check out. That's where we found the vintage cola or we wouldn't have seen that. So they may have other flavors. What'd you think of that? It was okay. It, it's, I like it. It's sweet. It, it's not bad at all. It's, it just doesn't taste like a really good root beer. It tastes like root beer, just not a really good root beer. It tastes like a flatter <laughs> root beer without the bite. Yeah, I, I, I get the... I think that's what it is. It's missing that strong like root beer flavor, that, that right. little sarsaparilla kick. It's know? missing the syrupy <laughs> sweet. It's definitely there is some a sweetness, flavor. but it's missing that depth, that deep uh, syrupy sweet. Yeah, I'm missing more of the, the bite, the kick than, okay. than anything. I understand that. It's got the flavor, just not the kick. So right. you, you miss that if you if you drink I drink root beers every day. Yes, it um, is. So it's it's missing that. Right. That little bite to it. Okay, so the it's last good, one though. is a ginger lemon. And it says our ginger lemon combines a kick of real ginger juice with sweet mulling spices and a pop of crisp lemon. Ginger is a natural digestive root, can help to soothe the stomach and increase blood flow. And it is 35 calories. Yeah, they say drink ginger when you're on a car trip um, if you get car sick. Eat ginger. Right. Like eat ginger snaps, so maybe this would help with your tummy. Ooh, that's a horrible. Um. No, it's actually, it's, it's better now that I've swallowed it. I can see where it would catch you off guard. Yeah. Because the ginger is strong. It's it's pure ginger. It's not sweet like a ginger snap cookie or something. Right. Um, it also doesn't have the burn like a ginger does. No, it doesn't. And I'm wondering if that's not because of the lemon. Could be. I think I would have loved to have tasted it without the lemon at all. Yeah. And just had the ginger... Kind of more like a ginger beer, 
than with all that lemon in it. Or um, ginger ale. Something like yes, that. yes, with that, just without the lemon. Mm -hmm. um, the lemon adds a little bitterness to it, I think. I think it does too. I, I don't mind it. I would absolutely drink yeah, it. It settled in better. Uh -huh. It really has settled in better. Once I took that at first drink, the first drink was like, ooh, that's some earthy stuff. Like I'm chewing on a root. Um, but once it's settled, it's, it's actually not too bad. It's better I, than the cold one. I like every single one of these and could drink every single one of these except for the vintage cola and i i could drink it but i wouldn't choose it i would never Not for choose $2 it and no if i was at somebody's house and they offered me because let's face it i'm never going to pay two dollars and fifty cents a piece for these again no. this is a one and done review because um i'm not going to pay that much for a drink uh but um, if I was at somebody's house and they were to offer me any of these, I would take them. Except for the vintage cola, I would say, "Do you? Could I just have a glass of water? That I would rather have water over the vintage right. cola." Yeah, I agree. Uh, but I think any of these are, are, good, these are good, depending on what you want. Yeah, and like I said, if you're if you're looking for that probiotics, bot botanicals, all that kind of stuff, um, then then these aren't bad to drink. Right. Um, but like I said, we're not judging it on the scientific evidence of any of that no, stuff. No, just, just going flavor. On flavor. Just flavor. Um, flavor to cost, it's horrible because because there's other drinks that are much cheaper that right. are cheaper. Um, I mean, much as good, if not better, flavors that are cheaper. Right. Um, but if you want those benefits, these flavors are okay to get that. Right. That, that'd be the only reason to pick these over a regular cola if, is if you're... If looking you're looking for those for benefits. benefits. Exactly. Or you're looking for something lower calorie. I agree. And now I've got the, the belches. <laughs> they're, they're coming now. Um, they are very pretty colors, though. Mm -hmm. As always, I'll have a picture for you at the end of all the nutritional information and all that good stuff. So hopefully you uh, keep watching and you'll see it all. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching. <laughs>